What's going on with y'all? It's your boy Sean Meachin. You already know what time it is, man. We got another review. We got them Lakers versus uh, Denver Nuggets. Uh, it happened on Sunday, December 22nd. Final score was 128 to 104. The Nuggets way. Uh, making, the, uh, making the Nuggets 20 and 8 now. And making the uh, Lakers 24 and 6. Obviously, if you saw the game, uh, LeBron didn't play. And I'm going to keep it real with y'all. I already know why he didn't play. Because uh, you know how um, Kawhi Leonard, he uh, been doing all that low management. So, you know, they like uh, LeBron, we're going to have to let you get some low management, you know what I'm saying, before this game against them, if he play. Because shit, you never know. Kawhi Leonard might be like, fuck that, I ain't playing today, you know. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm uh coming over, uh getting over a cold. I apologize, y'all. But uh, anyways, yeah, so LeBron ain't playing. I'm assuming that's why, because of low management. And he ain't, they don't want him to be overworked and then play against Kawhi Leonard. And two, I feel like uh, they don't want them to lose against the Clippers and also lose against Milwaukee because then, you know, it's going to start up some new talk about uh the Lakers and – and they probably ain't contenders in, so they like well to make sure that LeBron and Hunter we're gonna just set them out to uh Christmas Day. So that's what I feel. I could be wrong, but that's just my opinion. Um uh, But anyways, besides Brian, everybody else did play. Even uh Kuzma. Uh Kuzma had uh sixteen Four rebounds and zero assists. Um, it been a lot of talk about uh Kuzma. Like a lot of people been saying they want to trade him and stuff like that. Like honestly, right now I'm not sure. Uh, he did come back um on this game and played good. I wish I I wanted to see what the game would have uh, turned out to be against Milwaukee if Kuzma would have played, but he. he 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 uh decided to come back, you know, the next game, so it's whatever. Uh how we had eight points, one assist, and seven rebounds. I feel like how we're finna start uh making me feel better on his uh rebound and scoring, even though this game he was in single digits with rebounds and points. Or whatnot, but it's just like I've been seeing a little uh, uh, different how it out there on the court. So hopefully that my gut feeling is right, and he, uh, you know, finna step it up and be that superstar. And that's what it, it feel like. That's finna happen. Uh, Caruso, he had eight points and two rebounds, zero assists. He uh, he was kind of quiet out there. Uh, so yeah. KCP, he had six points, zero, I mean, two assists and three uh, rebounds. Uh, KCP um, had a, a few defensive plays that I had uh, noticed. I like KCP defense. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I just, like, I love his defense. I just wish he can, you know, give me 100% defense and 100% offense. You know, he had a, a nice little three, two that I was feeling. I'm like, there you go, boy. Also, uh, Bradley had some nice threes, too. He had uh, six points, one assist, and three rebounds. Oh, I'm sorry, two rebounds. I'm sorry. Yeah. And then Rondo. Rondo had five points, eight assists, and four uh, four rebounds. Now, with them eight assists, man, he had some uh, nice uh, fancy little passes that he set the players up with to get the um, – to get the high of eight assists. Now, it's crazy because the fact that he only got five points, but if you watch the game, you just thought he had more because he was kind of out there uh, playing uh, hard, like playing good defense, playing good offense. So, if you, like, was watching, I know you probably like, damn, he only had five, but most definitely. And he played 28 minutes, you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, I, I'm assuming Rondo getting back to his old self, they done gave him more minutes and stuff. You know, uh, McGee had seven points, one assist, 
and five rebounds. Hopefully, uh, seeing Giannis that'll make uh, that made uh, McGee like let me step it up. You know what I'm saying? Cause all these motherfuckers long, just like Giannis is. So I don't, I don't be understanding. Like I, don't, I just don't be getting it. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, McGee had seven points, one assist, five rebounds. It should have been ten rebounds. Should have been like twelve points. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. Um. Let me see. Danny Green had five points, two assists, and four rebounds. Man, I'm telling y'all, they steady yelling Kuzma. Man, Danny, boy, I'm telling you, you need to get your stuff together, man. Five. I just can't. I, I swear, folks, I just cannot wrap my mind around a guy who can shoot. But I ain't never got no damn points. I just can't wrap my like my mind just cannot wrap around that. Me personally, if I could shoot threes, I'd chunk about twenty of them motherfuckers up a game. But I know they probably going by a certain game plan and all that shit. But goddamn, my boy, get that shit together. Five points, two assists, four rebounds, bro. We not gonna go to the finals with your, with no numbers like that. We go, yo, get your ass traded for the uh, before the playoffs. Uh, that's all I know. But anyways, again, sorry for all the sniffles, y'all. I'm coming over. Uh, I'm getting over a cold. But anyways, uh, and we're going to talk about the, fin- the last final person, Anthony Davis. He had 11 rebounds, one assist, and 32 points. Uh, he-, he was out there cooking. I ain't going to lie. He was out there cooking. But he didn't cook enough for us to win. But he definitely was out there cooking, though. Uh, I feel like um, we got a lot of people we got to prove, prove wrong when it comes to the Lakers. And it's just like... We in that time era to where they think that you see a person do something two, three times, they just the greatest. Like, it take more. What they going to do in certain situations, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it shit just, it's bigger than just playing basketball, you know what I'm saying? You got mentally all that shit to fall into the same category. But uh, overall, uh, it was a, I, like, I feel like this was maybe like a rest game for the Lakers. Uh, to be prepared for uh, the Clippers so they can win on Christmas. So I'm pretty sure they get some type of bonus for playing on Christmas. So, you know, they I feel like they want to be 100% for this uh, Clipper game that they got coming up or whatnot. So I feel like that's what this was as far as Denver. Um, well, let's hope, hopefully after this little break, you know what I'm saying, let's come back strong, you know, starting off with the Clippers, you know. But this your boy, Sean Meach. And if you dig what I'm saying, man, hit the comments, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Holler at me. Let's chop it up how I like is the best. If you dislike what I'm saying, you can still hit that like button or hit the dislike button and hit the comments and tell me why you dislike any anything I said about uh, the game. Uh, but look, it's your boy, Sean Meach, and I'm out to the next Laker review. I'm gone.